How's it going? Flex, Pop, Talius, holy fuck, they're all here. I can't believe it. It's Monday. But... Rest assured. I'm here now. Have I ever worn this... sweatshirt on stream? I get the feeling I didn't. And thank you. A friend of mine would have thrown it away otherwise. So I took it. Free clothing? I'm beating capitalism. So easy. I stumbled upon a video of someone using the Twist of Fortune Morning Star. That one weapon that deals damage according to the amount of gold that the target is carrying. I was wondering if you could reserve, reverse pickpocket people to abuse it. And indeed you can. Wait. The rats. So you, you could put gold into somebody's pocket and then hit him with a magic hammer? That insta-kills you if you're a billionaire. Some people use it to one-shot bosses by just pumping 50k gold into their asses. Oh my god. <laughs> this game is fucking nuts. Ah. Uh, that's great. Okay, we're still... We're still here. We're not going to the archive yet. Because that seems to be, like, the main place to be. Uh, we had a little bit of fun in the boudoir. We learned a bit about the plains and other cities. In the portal room. But we're gonna go over here. And what I wanna do... I don't know if that's gonna work. Because of hope. The weird... Illusion that kept popping up and was like, Hey, I'm insane. Please save me. And... They were like, don't save me unless you're ready to like... Get the fuck out. And down where she is... Are like two spectators and a ton of imps that... Uh... Well, they, they have like a mechanic. Like if you deal radiant damage, you get twice the damage back as fire damage. Which, like, one-shotted Shadowheart Moving ahead. last time. So I'm gonna try doing that fight again. But what a cool, like, genuinely impressive location this is. It's insane. And, like, how easy to miss. Is the only way to get in to, like, pay... That person is shit ton of money, or are there like other ways to sneak your way in somehow? Uh, don't mind us, lady. We're. Wait, will she mind us? Saving the game. Lazelle? Let's cook in. Get cracking. Lock picking impossible. Wait, did we get the key? Such a beautiful house. Oh, wait. Strength? Strength check? I got this. Oh! Bless. <laughs> Guidance. Guidance is the best. We haven't gone in that way. We've There's like a little outside. Like a little crack in a wall where you can slip in. I haven't gone in the proper way. Let's see what happens. Saving the game. is held in chains just beyond. But where is your contract, you inglorious lump? Uh, are we... I don't know who... I turned everybody into a tiefling. <laughs> I don't know who is who anymore. And we're wearing, like, peasant clothes. Why can't I just free you now? The sound of the chains breaking will echo across the plains. Raphael will fly home furious when he hears it. I'm not gonna. I just kill the guards. Happens, your dad is dumb. I just want to kill the guards. I'm ready. No, no, like I have a choice. 
Hey, I'm ready. Trust in the party. Why can't I turn the camera? Why can't I walk? There we go. Oh, uh, Shadowheart. The House of Hope. Raphael's abode. Only this oh, time he hasn't invited us to his table. Hello. Where well, I'm, I'm trying to beat the, the jailers. House is excessive, overwrought, and ever so seedy. A perfect reflection of its owner. Did you see me have sex with that one devil, Lazelle? No? Okay. Karmic? I'm fine. Let's just get in and get out. <laughs> I also forgot everyone's a tiefling. I went in and there was a cutscene and I was like, who is this? <laughs> this is person. Does it mean we can change back to our gear? I mean, we don't have to impress anybody. At least, let, let's look like heroes. Oh, Electro Pops. God damn. That is a name I have not seen in ages. Holy crap, you followed me on the 6th of October 2017. I remember you were one of like the first people that actually talked to me. As I was doing this. God damn. Hope you're doing good. I'm still doing this. <laughs> I'm still doing this. There's a petrified debtor. So close and yet so far. Can I hope of escape frozen in time forever? We have a thing. We have a thing. I have five things. You're free! I mean, technically, you're free, right? Ah, oh, shit. Why does this keep happening? Oh, we're immediately doing it. Eldritch Blast. Uh, you can use a reaction to nullify the spell. Yes, do that. Don't cast spell. Knees high. To be honest, it's one of the nicest non-toxic chats that I was ever part of. I mean, it's very small. That helps. Like, there's not many apples to see the bad one. <laughs> but I appreciate it. I, I think we're all pretty chill. And reasonable people. And if there's somebody who's just being an ass for the sake of being an ass, then I'll make sure they... They, they know their place. Okay, if I jump, I can't rage. I don't really have another way to get over there. Uh. Most of the time, we're reasonable. <laughs> That's good enough. That's good enough. Can I shove them? Can I just shove imps down the thing? I don't have a bonus action. It's kind of weird that there are... Like, in, in my home games, I usually run it that you can use an action to do a bonus action thing. I'd, I'd rank, like, an action higher than a bonus action. But in this case, it doesn't work. So we're just gonna hit the guy. Reckless. Reckless? Let's... Oh, we don't need Reckless. Let's just hit the guy. Park, park. I forgot we only knocked them out. We're not using lethal force. Okay, this one imp lives. The rest dies. A thing that I overlooked for a while is that the trident is bound to you. If you throw it, it gets back instantly. Like, without even using a thing. Like, an action or a bonus action. Oh, damn. I think it would break even more. And just wait for the Dark Urchin and you'll see how fucked up we really are. I can't, I honestly can't wait. I'm really excited to just like hang back and let you guys go nuts and see what happens. 
I'm gonna stand right next to Hope as like a body shield. Okay, more imps. With the action economy? True. Like for the game specifically, yeah. You're right. Makes sense. Can they all Eldritch? They can all Eldritch Blast. What imps are those? God damn. Okay, I think Lizelle can just jump all the way over there. <laughs> I swear her jump distance is so busted. But I love it. And we're gonna save the action search for now. I'm just gonna... Make her jump here. First imp. Crit. Then we do a cleave attack. One imp down. And the last imp gets the soul breaker. Gets. No, we can use that on one of the tougher dudes. Let's do a lacerate. 16 damage and bleeding. So they could just do a thing next turn and die. Eldritch Blast. It's 4 damage. I wonder what Raphael will say. The thing is. I don't know if killing these dudes breaks the chains. I'm kind of hoping that I can just clear them, then go back up, get my contract, then come back down, then bust her out, and then we don't have to deal with all these people. You know? Opportunity attack, that's great. 15 damage for free. Second spectator rolling in. These guys are dangerous, and Shadowheart is eating it. Oh, mate. You can still go. Bite on Karlek. That's a miss. Shadowheart. You're running in here. On I go. You're gonna drink... A superior healing potion. 28. She's blessed now. Because of her... Cleric thing. And I gotta keep in mind not to do Radiant damage, but that's only on the Imps. That's not on the Spectators. I could do... Ah, uh, Flame Strike is not gonna... <laughs> I was about to do Radiant damage immediately. Turn on that is not gonna work. Can I banish? I can Polymorph one of the Spectators. Oh, that would be so good if that worked. Sheep. It's a sheep now. Amazing. Uh, there's no channel divinity. I think we're good. Still breathing. Okay. Don't hurt the sheep. Whatever you do, just let it be content. There is not a single thought behind those eyes. And we want to keep it that way. Uh, am I gonna Eldritch Triple Blast an Imp? Am I gonna go for the Spectator? Uh, Telekinesis. I can't just throw the dude off the edge, can I? Can I just Telekinesis his ass into the void? I'm gonna... I'm safe scumming a lot. But I honestly don't know if I tried that last time. Away I go. Just do it! Make your dreams come true! Okay, Shia. I'm sorry. That didn't work. It took one damage. And it got this place. Creatures suffering falling damage because of your actions take an additional 1d8 psychic damage. Well, how did I give it that? I'm loading. DM. Reverse my turn. Okay, Aaron. Great, being the DM and the player. It displaced itself. I'm gonna displace a buttload of damage in into its ass. To be so graphic for no reason. I don't think I ever realized you had bit sound alerts. I had them 
for like five years now. <laughs> and people use them so rarely that I always get fucking spooked whenever it happens. So we have no resistances on this guy. Um, I could pump a shatter in there. Hypnotic pattern. They cannot attack you. They cannot move or act. Oh, I would hit everybody <laughs> in there. Should I just fuck everybody up? Are all the enemies on the center platform? They are. Okay, let's hope that Karlak and Lazelle... That they can do this. Okay, one... Karlak is hypnotized, an imp is hypnotized, and a spectator is hypnotized. That's honestly great. That leaves us with one imp. We have a polymorph cheap. That's gonna stay there for five turns. So that should be plenty of time to hack away at that guy. Um, I'm not gonna miss... The oh, there's another imp up there. Didn't see that guy. I'm just gonna go behind this corner for now. And hide? Can I hide? Hiding is an action. Oh. Oh. I wanna stay there. Oh, it only took one damage. But it's hypnotized, so it can't do anything. Am I going to take an opportunity attack from this dude? Removed by taking damage or when helped. Okay, so we're gonna focus on the imps. Kill that imp. Run over to that imp. 400 XP from an imp. Easy. Another imp down. Let's misty step up to that imp. So it, if it tries anything funny, we're gonna chop it down. Close range Eldritch Blast. Probably disadvantage. What is the cheap gonna do? Nothing. And the other one is hypnotized. Dude, we got them. We got them locked down. That is amazing. So I should wait that one turn on that spectator. Let me jump up. Let me jump. Do I have like a target spell that is not radiant damage? I don't think so. <laughs> Can I hit everybody with like a mass... Mass healing word. If I get to the center, I can. Let's go. Let's just go here. It's a bonus action. And I jumped. What's wrong with me? Uh, third level cure wounds on yourself. That's fine. From here. Okay, I'm just gonna deliver some blasts. Let me do that. Pop, pop, pop. No crit. No crit. No crit. Dead. And I get temporary hit points. I get 17? Damn. That's nuts. Okay, done. So now I could have Lazelle. Yeah, Lazelle is gonna go for it. We're gonna do six attacks. We're gonna yeah, we're go we're going all in. Uh, I can't do a hunter's mark. Can't do that stage fright, no. We're just gonna chop three times. Chop number one. 15 damage. Chop number 2. 17. Chop number 3. 16. Action surge. 4. 17. 19. And 24 with a crit. That is over 100 damage. With... Fighter. 
in one turn on one target. Good shit. Wounding ray. Fight. Mm. That's some damage. Okay. <laughs> She's gonna take an opportunity attack from a sheep. I wanna see that. <laughs> I wanna see that. Come on, sheep. Do your worst. <laughs> okay. Oh, should we do harm? Six level spell. I've never cast harm before. I'm gonna cast it on the other guy. So let's do a moonbeam? Let's do a moonbeam. I haven't done that in a bit. 20 damage, and at the start of its next turn, it's gonna take more, but I'm probably... Oh, this guy's back. <laughs> Shit. Now I do a mass healing word. Everybody is a little injured, you know. Let's go. And everybody gets a bless for two turns. That's a... I don't know where that comes from. Is that a cleric thing? I wonder if this is worth the cost. Tabaluga. We could slap a cloud of daggers on this guy. Oh, we could do eye bite. Put a creature to sleep. Strike fear into a creature's heart. Or afflict a creature with disadvantage on attack rolls and ability checks. Let's go. It is sickened. Should save your spells. What's the worst that could happen? And I can do it once per long rest. Oh, it's one of those. That's neat. Okay, but I'm concentrating on it. End turn? I want to jump back here. I'm just jumping back and forth. What is it going to do? Wounding ray, of course. I'm concentrating. Paralyzing ray missed. Bite on Karlak missed. Opportunity attack from Karlak. It's flying over there. Oh, hey. Uh, Karlak is gonna... Rage. You can use the pool thing in Raphael's boudoir to full rest. Like, just stepping in it. That's gonna do it. Oh, I can't get up there now, can I? I can't jump! Fuck! Do we just do ranged attacks? <laughs> do I just do ranged attacks? Piercing strike. No, that's from the spear. No. I can't get up there. Can I throw myself? No. Uh, I'm just gonna shoot arrows. There we go. Uh, you don't have to touch that one anymore. You risk the opportunity attack. That's a miss. And then you chop into this guy. Let's start with a soul breaker. That is 21 damage. 20. And 20. That thing is dead. Bite on Lizelle is a miss. And it's Shadowheart's turn. Let's top things off. With a little guiding bolt. Second level. 22 damage. It has one hit point left. Oh, I could have moved the moonbeam. Don't you hate when that happens? Still on my feet. You're at home on your couch and you could have moved the moonbeam. No crits. Let's go. Okay, everything's dead. She is not free. As far as I can tell. She looks a lot more relaxed. Standing there. Oh, let's loot through the impage. Seven gold. This guy's a bit sleepy. We're gonna interrogate him later. Uh, let's turn off eye bite. Let's turn off Whatever moonbeam. Let's short rest. Last short rest for the day. Everybody's max health. 
230 gold. What is he gonna do with all that money? A burnished ring. A paralyzing eye stalk harvested from a beholder was boiled in a broth and poured down the throat of a dwarven ringsmith. Not one fortnight bends, he crafted this ring. I didn't know that's how it works. Paralyzing ray. Somebody use that? We could give that to Lazelle. We could give that to Lazelle. Movement speed. Yeah, let's give it to Lazelle instead of the Exalted Marrow. Did I pick it up? Lazelle. Get over here. Wear this. Hell yeah. So now she has Paralyzing Ray. Paralyzes the target for two turns. And it's a con save. I don't know what the DC is though. Alright. What now? Okay. This guy had a bunch of ingredients on him. But this is where you come down if you go the other way. Like this is from the outside. And I guess you kinda can jump them on that. I'm not breaking the chains way. yet. Spell right. casting abilities int for the right. Is that what that meant? It's hard to say if this sorry soul's demise should be mourned or celebrated as a release from whatever torment they were forced to endure. Okay, we got another petrified person here. A petrified debtor. Impossible to tell how long she's been there. But likely longer than she deserved. <laughs> I'm sorry. I mean, they're petrified. They don't feel pain, but I'm still sorry. They're gonna. If they ever get out of this, they're gonna wake up missing. Something. Carlic, what's up? Careful, soldier. I'm burning really hot. <sighs> Had a nice break in the hells. Now that we're back, my engine's in overdrive again. We're still in the hells. <clears throat> Let's move. The truck will take my mind off being barbecued alive. Carlic, we're still in Avernus. Is that bugged? That's so, what? <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. Can't you heal petrification? I tried it on another one and they turned into uh, like a puddle of ash. When I did that. So that didn't help. Hey Hope, what's up? How's it going? I, I saved your ass. I'm saving. Hammer is almost as sweet a sight as you are. Smash those chains! Not yet, because you told me to not do that unless I have my contract. I'm gonna go get that now. See ya later. And we gotta change into our peasant clothes again, otherwise all the servants will kill us. So let's go back up. We're going to the archive now. And you said the boudoir is a full heal? Just going into it? I feel like I was in it. And it didn't do anything. Let's see if something happens. I don't see anything. I don't see anything happening. Why is Carlac generating steam other than her heart? The faucets? But you actually have to curse. restoration faucet. Action, not reaction. Full spell slots. God damn. And that's every time? Now we're giga healed. Everybody has a thousand hit points now. God damn. Are you full rest? But you don't get short rest back. I mean, that would be... Don't look 
That would be nuts. I could have shaved. Shaved. I, I also could have shaved for today, but I didn't feel like doing that. Uh, I could have saved the short rest. Okay, this is the archive. And from what I remember, we basically have everything we need to get the thing. It's like a flashbang <laughs> at 3 a.m. I'm sorry. I don't consider these kinds of things. Like, I'm sitting in a room with, like, extra lighting. Like, everything is very bright all the time. Like, I'm... I'm, like, constantly flashbanged. Myself. That's Taming Hope Part 1. Corilla's transcript of a conversation between Raphael and her sister, Hope. Raphael, did your mother sing you nursery rhymes? What? Little Miss Taffel sat on her cattle, steam blowing between her lips. Along came her oven, in need of some lovin', and soon she had scalded hips. That's not a nursery rhyme. What the hell? Also, it's not 3 a.m. for you. <laughs> That's... I, I would not be doing that to... I, I know there are some people who stream like hella... Like, their regular stream times are like past 10 p.m. And then going into the night. I, I couldn't. Without face cam, maybe, but... I don't know. Uh, and yet you do not laugh, come hope you look so... Okay, so this is like Raphael capturing and interrogating Hope, and apparently Hope is the sister of the other halfling lady that we've seen, like, doing stuff for Raphael. So the situation is fucked up. Uh, this little realm around us, this house, you have mastery of it. And you of me. Sing me a song, Hope. I'm speaking to you. Now don't go silent. I'd hate to have to slit a child up the navel and rinse you in their insides. <coughs> that kind of stuff. Uh, da, 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 da. So she starts singing. Uh, I would have you master your own fate. Let me give you free reign to do so. Let's abandon this whole ugly imprisonment. Serve me willingly. Things would be as merry and jubilant as that song you've just given me. <laughs> eat shit. <laughs> okay, she's telling him to eat shit. Stuff your maggoty tongue in some other woman's ear. Here he looks upon her with such longing and hate. I think he might actually kill her. Oh, that was an error, my dear. Grave error. I shall see you soon. Yeah, then he tortured her even more. So she's been there for a good while. Orders for Archivist. Archivist, without delay, move some of the contracts and treasures to the main cache. We are excited about soon acquiring the crown of Carsis, and want certain things on display while the rest may be safely stored in the secret vault. What we want in the archive are the Amulet of Greater Health and Gauntlets of Hill Giant Strength. Oh shit. Raphael has a fucked up conception of nursery rhymes. <laughs> With a place, uh, with a place is reserved for the crown. Artifacts in the vault should be the staff of spell power and backup gold cash. So here in the archive are impervious fear. Oh, is that where my contract is? Gauntlets of hill giant strength. Set the wearer strength to twenty three. The enchantment has no effect if their strength score is higher without dude. I need that. And the amulet of greater health. Set the wearer's constitution to 23. Dude. Oh. Dude, imagine both of these things on Karlak. How much con does she have? 16. That would make her so... Oh, much tankier. Holy crap. She only has the amulet of Misty Step. Wow. That is insane. That is insane. The Nautiloid Adventures. 
Attaches letters a map with a detailed list of locations, all of which are familiar. Raphael, as requested, I've kept a close eye on the infected adventurers who fell from the Nautiloid and survived. They spent a while stumbling around like lost babes, easily distracted ones at that, but finally made it to Moonrise Towers. You should have seen the mess they made there. Pure delicious chaos. They killed Kafric. It was a hell of a show. I'm delighted I got a front row seat. And now they're in Worms Crossing. If the last few days are anything to go by, I'm expecting more blood, death and chaos. Which means they'll be running into you any day now. If anything changes, I'll keep you posted. Cor so Corilla was spying on us. Cool. I mean, she helped us out that one time, but... Hello. I cleanse the books. I comb each and every line for falsehoods and purge them pure. I would, like, go this to him. I would run up to Skelly and be like, Is this real? Can you see? There's the archivist. Let's talk to all the Skellies first and see what kind of books we can read. We do not demand silence, but please keep prayers, words of encouragement, and friendly conversation to a minimum. I like it here. An extensive, uh, extensive list of the names of the residents of Raphael's house, separated by hatters, loaned, punished, put to work, fed to pets, used as leverage, and missing. I guess I can't just go there and grab this thing, right? Amulet of greater health. It's trapped. The House of Wonders. Ooh. The High House of Wonders, Temple to Gond, the Gearsmith, and the Wonderbringer. The house is at the same time an elaborate collection of workshops, laboratories, and magical manufactories. What better way to worship the Lord of all smiths than by making mechanisms in his name? It's in the upper city. I wish this place were in the game. Maybe it is. Maybe it is. I don't know. But that's like the coolest place in Baldur's Gate. Like all the highest tech of the Sword Coast is in one spot. Great. What's in here? So many pretty things in the House of Hope. What do we have here? Goblets. A tour of Tempest. This book, long as an encyclopedia, but written in an untamed, barely legible style, describes the Tempest domain. From which some clerics can draw power. Looking at my cleric. You are a Tempest cleric. This is important. And look. When you are whipped with the wild winds or stricken until stick-like and burning from the gods lashing lightning tongue. Are you not suffused with the power of Tempest? Hey, How Queen Umberly and Lord Talos fight and fray over its dominion. But even they... Even day on high, no in truth Tempest can never be tamed, only channeled by the favored few. Reach up thy hands to the sky, outstretched awaiting breath of gods to blast the oblivious. Supplicate and ask to be drowned, to be blown asunder or to be destroyed. Or perhaps, perhaps to be granted such might to speak the words of Talos with thine own sweet hand. That's Tempest Clary. I, I gotta say, like, damage dealer-wise, the most OP cleric. That whole feature of like, oh, I can just do max damage a number of times per day. That's <laughs> so nuts. Oh, hello there, skeleton. How's it going? Just look. Exquisitely arranged down to the last thread. If you see him, tell him how beautiful it is. Ooh, what? This beautiful? Lorafian, who's that? Introduction to Lorafian by Palmer Juni Saga. It is no exaggeration to say that Corallon Lor Oh, that's like the He's like the main god of the elves. Uh he's the primary figure in the pantheon of elves. It is said that his tears mingled with those of Sahanine. Sahanain? Sah. Ah! Moonbow. Actually, create. Created. It's a typo. Elves. Uh. But yeah, they're like made 
from the tears of like the most powerful elf ever. As an almost the physiological reverse oblation God gives to his people is interesting. The elven people are not formed from Corlon's hip bone, his throat, his testicles. Instead, they arise from an expression of sorrow. Some scholars frame them then as an antidote to his pain. Corallon was at the time experiencing loss and feelings of betrayal. More traditional thinking, and here I quote the elven sage, this guy, places elves as sad as a species can be. This rings truer for me. Life after all deposits its fair share of difficulties on those burdened with living it. And elves endure it a long, long time. Oh, this, it's so sad to be hot and live for 5,000 years. Clearly it says they created delves. They're dungeon makers. <laughs> What's this one about? The Tourmaline Depths. God, there's so much lore here. That is insane. Blah, blah, blah. I'm, I'm not gonna... The, the halts, okay. Probably some adventure that takes you there. A fall of Neferil, oh shit. Oh man, oh shit. A first-hand account of the fall of Neferil, written by Raphael. How old is this dude? That's like a couple hundred... Oh, I think he's like a pretty powerful devil. Makes sense. Even a Maragon could not have kept a smile from creeping across its face when walking through those fields of the dead. Bodies broken, the land painted crimson from horizon to horizon. Karsis brought Neferil's cities tumbling from the skies. And for a brief glorious moment, he created a spectacle of such utter horror... It was worthy to be the tenth hell. Oh shit. I delighted in it until I realized that the one thing I was sought I saw it was not to be found among that delicious carnage. The crown it had been stolen. Okay, so he's looking like Raphael is getting ready to get the crown of Carsis. And this is about the power. All 100 chapters of this dense book describe the coronation of Raphael as Archdevil Supreme of the Nine... Wait, does he want to become Asmodeus? What the fuck? But the circumstances vary in each case. Some versions are written as if historical fact. Others are imagined futures, but all end with Raphael wearing the crown of Carses. One in particular catches your attention. Uh. In the end, it was the prism bearers, that's actually our party, who came to him seeking salvation, and he laid out a course for their survival. They would be free of the parasite, the sword codes would be cleansed of elephants, and Raphael would receive the crown for his part in the victory. From the moment he met them, it was inevitable. The realms would weep to see his glory. I fucking doubt it. I'm here to mess shit up. Where's the archivist? Who's running this place? Excuse me? A guest? Are you a client of the master? Or a visitor from elsewhere in the hells? I do not believe you were invited. One moment. I have my clothes on. I shall consult the visitor's schedule. Hmm. Hmm. I, I'm a servant. Hmm. Most irregular. The schedule is all but clear. Can you the say schedule? Are here. Please say schedule. Have you ever met Hope? Access the schedule by reading his thoughts. I'm so bad at that. Uh, I just, I'm just, I'm just here to explore. Be my guest. Even if you're not scheduled for an appointment, this is a civilized place. As long as you don't remove any of the artifacts, nobody will remove your skin. Let's remove Unless every Master artifact. Pyle decides otherwise, of course. Okay, uh, do you have highlights? A fine pair of gauntlets that allow the wearer to twist the head from even the most resilient malingerer. An amulet that causes the blood to surge and the heart to swell. 
along with other parts hmm. most invigorating oh shit and awaiting installation we have secured a rod that gathers the weave around it in great quantities just as surely a shit gathers flies oh, i have that one i stole that i mean i saw that one have you met hope yes nasty little gadfly I'd swat her if the master wasn't so fond of tormenting her. So, what if I wanted to change my devil deal? I commend you. Thinking is a marvelous pastime. You should have third, fourth, and fifth thoughts about your deal as well. You can think about all the ways you're never going to break it. Oh shit, okay. Uh, deception. I don't want to break it. Raphael said I could make some edits and clarifications to the wording. How about I break bits of you until you tell me how to get what I want? Or Raphael won't care about losing one measly contract. Just let me have it and I'll leave. <laughs> I'm going deception. He, he told me. It was cool. Like, we're, we're like good buddies. I'm going Dark One's, Dark One's own luck. With extra D10. So we need at least a nine. That's a seven. We got one from the D4 and the D10. I'm using inspiration. Fuck it. Wow. It's a four. Come on. That's a three. That's a ten. Hell yeah. You got your... Yeah, that was a dark one's bad luck, yeah. He can be so indulgent of his favorites. While most irregular, I shall take your preposterous request into consideration. Submitting the necessary paperwork will take no more than six infernal cycles, amounting to 37 of your mortal years. I recommend you indulge in the pleasurable torments of the boudoir while you wait. I already have. What do I do now? Conducts his most private matters of business and pleasure. You will need this to gain access. Wait, what? The resident favors their favorites. Satisfy them, and they may put in a good word on your behalf. What, what boudoir invitation? I've done this or made. Disheveled and with a lingering odor of blood and sweat. I already fucked the devil. I did I the hope thing. You found the boudoir to your liking. I've done it. Disheveled. Huh? What do I do with that? The Scotty Gilded invitation admits the bearer to Raphael's boudoir for a private meeting. Melts overwhelmingly of Palmarosa and Pepper. Raphael's own perfume. But do I go there now? Raphael sees everything. I've done the thing. You may have gone all the way, but now you gotta go all the way. Are we going to fifth base? With a devil? Like the devil is not even here anymore. <laughs> They're not even here. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, uh, the, the escape the deal. Fulfill the deal. Found the contract. It's protected by an impenetrable magic field, but we learned the password. We know the password to turn it off. D do I just... Yeah, I, I know the thing. Fifth base is where you access the fourth hole. That's cursed. Just that chat message out of context is <laughs> cursed. <laughs> it's right here. It's right, like I can just go there and whisper the password and I get the thing. Right? Excuse me. Raphael has reserved this pedestal for contract with Raphael. Your signature bold at the bottom. The earthy smell of fresh ink still lingers. 
What if I would have never signed a contract? Like, what if I just shoot Raphael away at the beginning? Reach out to sense how far you can reach before being repelled. It is I, Raphael. Lower your defense. <laughs> Give me my heart's desire. That's the magic word. The magic away at your words. Your contract is within reach. But Stupid devil. Won't go unnoticed. Wait, can I just talk to the guy and be like, hey, did you see me deactivate that thing? Disheveled and <laughs> he's still he's still mumbling on. So let me let me let me try something else. So this guy is busy right now. He's looking at us. Do a music pop that is a great idea. Tabaluga's gonna draw the attention. We're gonna play of divinity and sin. Ain't that fitting? Great little ditty. <laughs> It only gets the archivist. Does Always read the fine print. Thanks. Thanks for that. Okay, I'm gonna disarm the marble plate. C20. We got a bonus off. Eight. That's one down. Light steps. Okay. And you go for the second one. Consider me intrigued. An efficient path. So many pretty things. Let's go for the second one. Hey, okay, look away, everybody. Oh, I gotta perceive the thing Come first. Together. This way. Better heart, could you <laughs> like Lizelle is just waiting <laughs> for Shadowheart to point out that there's a trap. <laughs> Okay, and back we go. Archivist is busy. And Lazelle is gonna disarm. Not enough resources. Okay, everybody end their turn. Let the environment play out. Okay, we're good. We're going back to Lazelle. Oh, I didn't have an action. That was the issue. Hell yeah, really good rolls. And there go the gauntlets. Without delay. Okay. And then I assume this thing has some kind of... This has nothing on it. A most cherished client. The ink is dry, the contract signed. The threads of fate shall now unwind. That's cool. He did he wrote a cool little song lyric. Okay. Let's pass around some insane magic items. So this gets your constitution to twenty-three. Which is pretty intense. Once per long rest and scoring a crit on a humanoid, the wearer can paralyze the target for two turns. I'm gonna lose Misty Step on Karlak, but I think that's okay. She got Thunder Thighs. She can jump like crazy. So currently she has 150 hit points with that amulet. <laughs> 182. Oh. That's just 30 hit points on top for free. Imagine Raphael coming back and being like, wait, how did someone steal my stuff? How did someone sleep with my escort? How did someone touch my portals? Okay. And the gauntlets of hill giant strength. If I give them to Karlak... It only reduces her AC by two. And it bumps up her strength to 23. Normally it's 18. Lazelle already has 20. It's kind of a waste on me and Shadowheart. Goes with Karlak. It goes with Karlak. 
Damn, she's gonna look so badass. That was just the biggest buff in the history of buffs for Karlak. She went from 14 constitution to 23 and from 18 strength to 23. Bruh. Like his security can't get much better, he literally lives in hell. <laughs> I mean, didn't they steal the crown of Karsis from his vault as well? Wasn't that where it was kept for the longest time, like Raphael had it? But he didn't do anything with it? And then Gortash. No, they stole it from another devil. It was in the Hells. And then Gortash stole it from somebody else. Okay, the Archivist is really neglecting his job right now. We're just gonna take advantage of that. Let me save because we just took all the good shit. This piece of humble parchment contains your promise to give Raphael the crown of Carsus. Without it, you are unbound from him forever. Tear it in two. Your blood suddenly runs cold. Raphael knows what you've done. What's happening? Okay, okay, okay. We're getting to to hope. Hope we're going to hope. I've got good news. A bad news. A worst news. Good news. You got what you came for. Successful visit. Great success. Fantastic work. Bad news. So many things will be on fire when you step outside of this room. You included. That's okay, no, right? It's hell. You expected it to be hot. Worst news, Raphael's on his way home, and oh boy, oh boy, he is sprinting mad. He planned for this. I know you did. You have everything under control. It's really important that you don't panic, even when your eyes evaporate from the heat. Come to my prison, bring the hammer, break my chance, and then we exit stage any which way. I'll try. Work as a cockroach, lickety split if you don't mind. Oh, hey. Save the game. I have to pee really bad. So I'm going to do that now because I feel like oh, I'm still making music. <laughs> I had a feeling that's going to be intense as hell. You go pee too. Let's all pee together. I'm right back. Okay. Okay, before I step out there, I don't think we drank any of our elixirs. I can give myself fire resistance. Can't I just 
do that. Don't I? I have some ability that is like, oh, you can choose. There it is. Fiendish resistance. We're gonna go fire. Karlak is naturally fireproof. So we just need two drinks. Elixir fire resistance. Or Shadowheart. And Lazelle. Everyone in the party is fire resistant now. Never a dull moment. Let's open the door. See how bad it is. Smoldering eternal adapter. Is hope. Can I just wait? Softer than a whisper. Can I just blast, blast, blast? I thought I blasted you all. A vengeful boar? Where do you come from? I didn't hire you. Where the hell do you come from? Do we throw? How do I throw my weapon? That is not through this menu, is it? How do you throw your weapon? There. So you said if I throw it, it immediately comes back? Oh. Oh, that thing. Should I have snuck? I feel like I should have snuck. This'll help. And it's immediately back. That is so cool. Can I throw it again? I can throw it twice! Bruh! That's sick. What do I do with Hope? Do I talk to Hope? Hey, what's up? Alarmed Depter. Uh... <laughs> This, like, Hell Sphere is really bad. 200 hit points. 66 fire damage. Enemies and objects within 10 feet. It's an aura. It's not touch. No choice but to keep going. Can, can I stop this thing somehow? Can I, like, use telekinesis? And, like, chuck it out the window. I can't do that. Does that mean we're just gonna run? Don't waste a step. I'm just gonna run. And I'm gonna dash. And my turn. That's how far it can move. Polymorph it. Never a dull moment. Is, is that can I actually do that? Can you polymorph this thing? <laughs> I I made it it's Is it burning? <laughs> this looks intense. <laughs> Super Saiyan cheap. <laughs> you can turn the hell sphere into a sheep. With Polymorph, who would have thought? My patience I sure didn't. Not one false move. It still has the Hellish Sphere effect. Is it? Wait, does it have the AoE? <laughs> it does! It's just a sheep that if you get too close, it's gonna burn you to death. <laughs> Where are we even trying to go? I can't walk outside this place. Still in shadow. Why does Lizelle have her own thing? She has her own. Okay. She's in here now. Devoured Eternal Adapter. Are we just gonna. I guess we're just gonna burst our way through these guys. <laughs> 
That's an imp now. Executioner. Once per long rest, when you kill a creature, your next attack roll will be a crit. Yes. That's a one shot. Good shit. Let's immediately jump up to that one. Just across the Karlik is just gonna tank up front. And then the rest is gonna follow. And deal damage. Let's fly over here. And let's hope that the Hell Sphere sheep is not gonna get too close to us. Another boar. Kalik barely takes damage from this. This is amazing. Uh, I could miss this step, but I don't think I'm gonna do it. We're gonna save that. Lazel, would you please fly over here? And would you please give us your signature triple chop? Don't even need three. Damn. Ah, oh, fuck, you're still here? Ah, oh, do I have a potion of invisibility on you, please? Potion of flying. Can I make her drink it from, like, another person's inventory? Or do we have a potion of speed? We have 14. I actually can. Okay, she's hastened. She's just gonna... Moving. Run, 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 run. Dash. Run, 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 run. Take some fire damage. Immune to burning. How does that work? Okay, there's hope. Run all the way to hope. I think, I guess, I hope I'm right. My prison is just on the right. I mean, can't we go through the boudoir over here and then into the crack in the wall? Is that not, I can't, okay. Fuck it. This person. Is doing nothing. <laughs> the sheep is actually destroying everything. <laughs> no way. That is fucking hilarious. That is a sheep that deals 66 fire damage in a 10 foot radius to everything. <laughs> wow. That's incredible. Okay, Karlak. Just go in there. Show him who you are. Oops. Do we do a legacy of a Oh, it's fire. That won't do much. Just gonna hit it again. 20 damage. Good shit. I'd wish they'd rename the effect to Hellish Sheep. I mean there's always room for patches. There's always room for that. Eldritch Blehast. And I'm gonna send... I'm gonna send another two just on these statues, just because I can. There we go. Great. I got 17 temporary hit points. I am fury. I am death. Lazelle is pissed. He's gonna fly over here. And then I'm gonna make her dash another however long she can dash. Dude, what's her movement speed? 60 feet! What was that? Another one! Do I have a scroll of polymorph? Shit. Shadowheart, you can't polymorph. You're concentrating on the other polymorph. You should get the hell out of here. Yep. Just get the hell out of here. Have to keep going. Keep going towards hope. This guy joined the fight. He's not that much of a. Oh, we can still attack. Oh shit. Uh. And jump over to him. I'm just gonna hit him with second level guiding bolt. That does the trick. Vengeful Maragon. 
These guys are terrifying. And he has the Radiant Protection as well. That if you deal Radiant damage, you get twice the damage as Fire damage back. Okay, extra attack, Devil's Sight, Magic Resistance. Nasty. Nasty little shits. Let's do another second level Guiding Bolt. Crit, 30 damage. What's happening? What's that sphere? Wait. Is that the sheep? Oh, the sheep turned back. Okay, okay, okay. Sheep turned back. Shadowheart got a good hit. Um, Let's start with Tabaluga. Flying over here. And I think I have a scroll of Polymorph. Don't I have a bunch of those? Hold monster. Banishment. Doesn't work on a sphere. There it is. Scroll of Polymorph. Come on, sheep. Let's go. Another health sheep. Okay. And that's my turn. What's this? Kalek, ignore the sheep. Power jump. And then do a little rush attack on this guy. Watching Ray won't do much. Can we just run it? Yeah, we can. And attack. <laughs> that was such a half-hearted poke. Oh no, what does he do into himself? Oh honey. Okay, that was it. Lizelle. Hop. Almost there. I'm so excited. I could scream. I'm trying to save you. Let's run over to that person. Get them involved. What's over? There's more over there. So I guess I could just go back the way I came and book it, but we're trying to bust hope out. Shadowheart needs to act fast. She's going to act all the way over here. And throw... Let's do a third level guy. Oh, I don't need that much first level. Good enough. And damage. Not good enough. <laughs> then she's also gonna cure wounds. Third level. 19. Good shit. And we can do fourth level <coughs> spell restoration. Oh man, there's a lot of moving parts on this. Am I burning? There's a sheep standing next to me. Forever indebted. Oh, that's the transformation. Okay. Okay, we have sheep, we have hell sphere. We have Karlak. We're gonna ignore the sheep. We're gonna ignore the sheep. We're gonna jump. Can I jump right next to him? I actually can. Holy damn. Big jump. Zero fire damage. And now we're just gonna attack twice. Let's... Oh, she rolled a one. Reckless. Crit. And dead. Sick. Tabaluga is gonna fly like an eagle. But an eagle that has 50 tadpoles in its brain. And he's gonna dash and run even further. And Lazelle is gonna be the first one to jump in the hatch. Is that gonna transport everybody? Do you have anything to say to this? We're going in. Who has the hammer? Who has the Orphic hammer? Who's actually carrying that? Tabaluga is carrying that. Now Lizelle is carrying that. And we killed all the guards. So it, I actually did a smart one. 
by getting rid of these guys first. Because if I would have gotten the contract and then had to do this fight, oof, that would be rough. I'm going to make her equip the hammer. So Lazelle is wielding the Orphic hammer now. What? <laughs> Don't tell me you were a trap. The whole house is tumbling down and Raphael striding across the plains to come catch a mice. My swing that big beautiful hammer, crack open my chains and let's get out of here. It's time to fly this coop on a hope and a prayer. Any advice when it comes to fighting Raphael? Don't! But if you must. Make sure I'm with you. He makes mistakes when he's angry, and seeing me running free will make him as angry as an axe head. Let's fucking do he's this. So brave, but we really don't have a choice. Go, Lazelle. Go, 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 go. Mm. Or do I want the rest of the gang here? I'm gonna get the rest of the gang here before we go, go, go. I like going in. Shadowheart. Going in. Tabaluga. He's a little extra. He's gonna be flying in. Let's go. Everybody's here. Uh, Lazelle is gonna helm the ship. She has the Orphic hammer. What's up, Hope? How's it going? A little bit of small talk? No? Okay. I wanna fly up here. Did he hear that Dave the Diver got a major update? I did not. What's it do? Is it like more towards end game? Content? Okay, we're flying over here. Breaking the other hammer. Oh, breaking the hammer. There we go. Free! I never thought I would be believed I could be hoped I might be. Heads will roll! Let's go before it's ours. But we must dress the holly fint in the room. We can see how you avoid looking at me. I must be so terribly mutilated after all these decades of torture. Honestly, you look pretty fine for somebody that... Tell me how bad it is. You look normal. Frenetic! What's up? We just saved hope. But now we gotta get out of here before shit goes... I mean, it's going down. I turned a giant fireball into a fire sheep that's chasing us. Let's get out of here. We both know that's not true. But, but thank you for being so kind. You look normal. You actually... No, really. You look fine. Seriously, there's nothing wrong with you, physically at least. No, you look good. You truly are the kindest fool I've ever met. Don't fall in love with me. We don't have time for that. Get, get out. That's the hopeful version, of course. The likely version is that we are the messes and he is the chopper. Onwards! Okay. Where are we going? Lizelle? Back to your big badass sword of the plains. There we go. Uh, gang. Gang. Let's get together. Do I want to come out the same way that I went? Is that a smart idea? Are you guys coming? Hello, Hope? Talk to me, Hope. No time for chat. It's tempting to delay the inevitable. This is it. The big showdown, the final act, the glorious run that comes to us all. There is also the slim possibility that we win. I'm trying. What can she do? Mage armor, revoke guest status. Hope banishes one of the unwelcome guests from her house forever. Fuck! What is that? Mass cure wounds, that's dope. Mass healing word. Preserve life. I can cast that on. With Shadowheart. 
just cast it on everybody. Sorry for doubting your Don't abilities. What does she have? Wait, she can do a divine intervention? Golden generosity. Arm die. Wait. <laughs> Wait, I could just use her divine intervention? I. I, I gotta try that out. Let's use divine intervention for a holy weapon. Devotee's Mace. Wait, does she have that? She has it. Healing Incense Aura. Oh, she has way more stuff. What is Healing Incense Aura? Emanate a Soothing Aura. You and nearby allies re regain 1d4 hit points at the start of your turn. That's pretty cool. That's all it does, though? Come on. <laughs> that's kind of... That's a one once a campaign spell. Just out of view. And it kind of... It's kind of eh. For ten turns. But still. Never wanted the easy path. Okay, everybody sneak. We are Let's in sneak mode. She's sneaking? Could you... S can you... S you can't sneak. I, I can pickpocket. Wait, I can pickpocket hope? Nah, no, I'm not gonna do that. Okay. Let's go. <laughs> She's in combat with the Hell Sphere. Shadow Heart. Please polymorph the fool. There we go. Everybody else. Make haste. So now we gotta go to where we came from. <laughs> Lissel is out of combat. And <laughs> still sneaking. Wait, they all are. It's only those three. Okay, you guys gotta catch up. You guys gotta catch up. Aye, aye. Alex is gonna trigger these guys. Oh, there's a bunch of them in here. What is that? Iron Doors to Hope. Okay. We, we gotta catch up. Yes. Bolts Ring Magic. You are an ally, receive 1d4 bonus to attack rolls and ability checks. You know what, Karlak? Treat yourself. Done. Okay, you... are gonna... I'm trying to make her jump without burning. There we go. And then you're gonna dash. And then you're gonna go down there. There we go. We're just gonna ignore this sheep. That's what we're gonna do. That's the whole plan. Ignore sheep and run. Oh, the concentration state. That's lucky. Heading there. That is lucky. What's the sheep gonna do? Is it gonna go for Tabaluga? Concentration is still there? Okay. Uh... Tamaluga is not part of the fight. Oh, he took big damage. And it's not his turn. That sucks. Okay, okay, okay. Fink. I'm gonna turn on that healing aura. I'm just gonna... We're just gonna turn that up. And you're gonna run in. Karlek. Is gonna run in. Scroll of Shatter. Let's go. Shatter these guys. Over there. Run in there. Pull the full party. Pull them all. She has 180 hit points. What are they? They can't do shit. 
Revoke guest status. Oh, it's a touch. A touch spell. Then let's slap. Ah, oh, bless. It's not good either. Preserve life. Another channel divinity. We only have one of those left. We could pop a mass cure wounds, but that's probably overkill. She doesn't have... She has Guiding Bolt. Okay, I was about to say, she doesn't have anything. Guiding Bolt on that. Fuck! Let's go. That's a piggy. I need Shadowheart as far away from this sheep as possible. And then she's going to Guiding Bolt 4th level. The pig. Oh, it has the thing! Shit! Oh, that's bad. Uh, potion, potion, greater healing potion. Fuck, that was 60 fire damage on her. That was a big ass sheep. I did the thing again, I'm sorry. Can you throw the sheep into the abyss? I'll try. Everything just exploded. But I really hope that Raphael's not gonna show up soon. Stop exploding! Stop hurting Shadow... They're only going for Shadowheart. He activated. What does that mean? He has three turns of deactivated. Eldritch Blast, that's fine. Don't kill Hope! Please. You can kill Karlek. She, honestly, she probably can handle this. Oh hey, can I telekinesis this ball? Half is blocked. Half is interrupted. I gotta run away from this thing first, don't I? Time to press ahead. Oh, I don't want to absorb intellect. I want to pick up a ball. I can't do it. Target is... It's like in the door frame. That's probably getting it stuck there. Do we have glue? Can I, like, glue something? Can't really glue anything. I could hit... <coughs> Shadow Heart with this Moonbeam, but it would hit four other people. I think Shadow Heart would get it, right? She gets it. It's for the greater good. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, it's, I'm almost dead. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. I got. Don't I have like super crazy healing potions? I, I have something like that. There. Supreme healing. 50 hit points. I'm good. That was worth the damage. I just took like 70 hit points damage. I did it again! I'm so, I, I'm panicking, okay? This is... This is... This is rough. Let's do channel divinity. Everybody's in range. Lizelle! What are you doing there? I forgot about that. Okay, we're going to... Misty step into the frame. The effect is so harsh, my paladin and cleric couldn't do shit. I completely forgot Lizelle was still here. Where's her initiative? Wait, she can't do stuff anymore? But why? We can do a mass healing word on top. Fourth level. Everybody get healed! And I can't really move that much anymore. Move over here, take a little bit of fire. Fine. Karlak, poke number one. 
Dead. Carlic poke number two. Dead. Carlic happy. Let's end this. Shadow hard. Don't do radiant damage. Do any other damage. I don't have any other damage, do I? I could do harm. But that's... Is that on touch? Oh, they got a good save. They got a good save on that. I could do spirit guardians with necrotic damage. On... Fifth level? And then we just jump on the table. 18 damage. 31 damage. Sick. The ball is gonna... It, it jumped. <laughs> the ball jumped. Opportunity attack. Lizelle gets humped by a ball. Shadowheart gets Eldritch Blast. Spirit Guardians is still there. Come on, move into the range. Eldritch Blast on Tabaluga. Flying over there. Tabaluga is gonna... Fly like an eagle. All the way over here. And we can still jump? No, we don't have movement for that. Uh, I'm just gonna... No, I'm just gonna... Eldritch Blast. The imps. Let's go. Imps down. It's only one sphere left. And that's it. And then we're out of this place. But I feel like I want to preserve spell slots, so I am death. I'm gonna just gonna keep it cool. Let's paralyze this thing. It fucking saved and fly over here. Yeah, let's get everybody out of here. Little second wind. Cup ammo. Back to full health. Hope. Hope comes here. There are three things you need to know about Raphael. He's almost home night closer than a kiss. His favorite color is blood. Uh huh. And he probably knows a thousand ways to kill us. Cool. This is going to hurt. Nah, it's fine. Fine. We're fine. We're gonna run. We're gonna open the door. There's gonna be a portal. We jump in. We're back in Baldur's Gate. Happy ending. I know it. I know it. Should we do a quick misty step? Or are we just gonna jump? He's really not a jumper, is she? Let's jump here. Just get out of the fire. Yeah, this fear is gonna go for Tabaluga. He's tanking it. He is tanking it. And he is flying next to Karnak. And dash. One day I'll catch a break. Damn, where's Raphael? What? Make way. Does that room have its own song? This room has a song. <laughs> I didn't know that. What the hell? Yeah, I'm gonna get everybody in there. Heating up. I've got it. I'm gonna get everybody in there. Uh, let's Can't get Shadow Heart. Dash. Shadowheart, would you be so kind and thank you. I'm pretty sure the flaming sphere can't open a door. Put him up. And I feel like it would be fitting if Carlite uses the portal to get us back. What is it? Time slows for a moment and the air becomes thicker. The master of the house is coming. Oh shit. 
You. Me? What? What's up? Who's that? Did we kill that dude? There are many things in your world that I loathe. Litters of kittens, chattering children, the noise, and the chaos of it all. In my world, in my house, there is order, and there are rules. You have broken the most important rule of all and committed the cardinal sin. You went against your word and defied our contract. In doing so, you brought the chaos of your world into mine. Oh, that's I on you, buddy. I not abide it. Your house is in disarray. The guards can stop me from freeing hope. Gorilla, this is your chance to be free. Help me take him down. I'm gonna, I'm gonna smack, like, when do you get the chance to smack talk a dude like him? Your house is stinky. And I, I fucked your wife, husband, sex worker. Or, or do we bring Corilla on our side? I feel like you only get one sentence and then shit goes down. Let's, ho let's get Corilla. Corilla, come on, lady. I got your sister. You think I'm on your side? The only reason you're here is because Raphael allowed you to be. Deception check? <laughs> permitted you the freedom to decide your own fate. Please? Persuasion? You've been smart, selfless, saved the world. Instead, you came here and risked everything. It's the fatal flaw of mortal kind. Take away their free will and they call you a tyrant. Allow them to indulge it and they tyrants you would have been heroes if you'd only dealt fairly with me instead you're not so different to doomed casas overreaching your limits and burning your world to ash wrong 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 they will save their world and smash you to smithereens it's this charming naivety that makes your company such a joy to me hope i'll even forgive this little rebellion once you're suitably chastised. Try us, this bitch. This isn't a rebellion. It's a revolt. I'm revolting! <laughs> then hope dies today. Let's go. Commander, you can salvage a trophy from these insects when I'm done with them. Gladly. Your gear. Join the winning side. Afraid to fight me. Wait, I can persuade. Is that a pit fiend? No fucking way. DC 30. Oh. Where's all my bonus? Oh, I'm good in deception, not in persuasion. And I don't have the, the luck. Oh, dude, we need. We need, like, at least a 16, 17, 18. Come on. What? Dude, I want to convince the pit fiend to join me. I'm going to use one inspiration. How many we got? We got four. I'm going to use two inspirations. We need, like, a 17, 18, 19. God damn it. Or a crit. I take a crit. One more time. One more time. Come on. <sighs> it was 10, 11, 12. What the fuck? <laughs> wow. Gah. You overestimate your abilities. I stand with Restart? You. Nah, it's canon. If you have any last words, make it quick. Camera man, you're filming my neck. Take a moment to finish you. Wait, please, I have one final proposition. 
It's twice as long as Harleep said it takes to finish you. Who was Har Harlep again? If I die, Baldur's Gate is doomed. If you kill me, you'll never get the crown. What is the one final proposition? I want to know that. That's the incubus in the bed. Oh, shit. <laughs> Am I going to drop that on him? I'm going to drop it like, oh, shit. You contemptuous creature. And when he's angry, he does mistakes. That's great. Raphael, Yorgir, Vengeful Cambion, Vengeful Cambion, Corilla, Vengeful Cambion, Vengeful Cambion, Vengeful Cambion, Pillar of Souls activated. What does that mean? Let's do a psionic backlash on those fire rays. Karlik is like right in front of him. I can't examine him? I can't examine anybody. Wait, what? Hell, hell. Hell has its laws. Hell, hell. Effect in the cause. He's singing. But hold your applause. Squirm, squirm. Why is he singing to me? <laughs> what? I'll go in. Kalik is gonna focus on the main baddie. This guy's some Disney villain. <laughs> We're going reckless. 25. Crit. 39 damage. Soul pillar proximity. I don't want to know what that means. The music is nuts. Okay, we're keeping the rage. Zoom in. Is he actually singing? I'm gonna check next verse. Your gear. Missed. Invisible. Wait, he's back. He's not singing. Oh. Okay, we we need some hope. Opportunity. Another 22. He's already down 100 hit points. Consume souls. Punish divinity. Ooh. Okay, Lizelle. Can I get Lizelle next to his ass? She's gonna get some opportunity attacks, isn't she? Or can oh no, she can run around. Run here. Jump there. Oh, he's got some high defense. Soul pillar proximity four. They got a hundred hit points. Like that's not easily broken. I'm gonna do a soul breaker. That is such a low chance to hit. That's insane. Wall of stone. What else do we have? Arrow of transposition. Don't I have an arrow that silences the target? Smoke powder arrow. <laughs> I could just shoot everybody with that. <laughs> That's a big explosion. God damn. No, we're just chopping him six times. Or I go for the Cambions. Clear those out of the way. I kind of want to let Corilla live. I feel like if we kill Raphael before we kill Corilla, she's going to break. Crit, and he's stunned for two fucking turns. Ooh. Another crit, dude, Lizelle. 
I should have dated you from the very start. Action surge. Okay. He's down 160 hit points. The pillar pillars, the pillars are vulnerable to force damage. You should be able to examine them. It's so dumb. You don't know that. It, it's it bugged for some reason. I think I tried to examine one as a pop up happened, and that broke it. Two Tabalugas at one hit point. Orella. Oh, three misses. Tabaluga still standing. One hit point. It's Shadowheart's turn. Can we get a... Heal. Sixth level spell. Couple ammo. Plot armor. Mass healing word on top of it. Bam. Everybody's blessed for two turns. Do I have big damage for these dudes? I could shatter all three. Raphael is stunned for two turns. Shit goes down, you have divine intervention. I do. I want to shatter these guys. 29, 38, 14 damage. That's honestly really good. And then I'm going to miss this step. Up here. Shadowheart saved Tabaluga's life. Hope! What can Hope do? Hope can't really get out of here without opportunity attacks. Disengage is an action. I could do a mass healing word as well. She can't really do shit, can she? Uh, yeah, she's gonna disengage. So she doesn't get chopped to bits by opportunity attacks. She's gonna run over here and mass healing word. Let's go for it level. Bam. We gotta keep the damage dealers alive and then just... F like, unload on Raphael. Opportunity attack is a miss. You get a psionic backlash. 8 damage. 3 misses on Shadowheart. Amazing. Karlak doesn't give a damn about opportunity attacks. Try her. If you kill Raphael, the rest will disappear. I, the entire House of Hope will disappear. <laughs> that would be dope. Gaping wounds on Raphael. Let's go, another hit. Let's fucking go. Kill him. Crit on hope. Disarming attack. She saved against that. Lizelle is just gonna go for him. Ooh, what was that? Oh, that was this guy. And he goes invisible again, dude! What a guy! What a guy! Now they're really... Oh, she dropped her holy mace. That's not good. Dude, you're stunned. Shut up. Hunter's Mark. And three chops. Three chops. Three chops, right? Or do we do some tadpole shit? No, we do triple chop. I'm gonna have Lazelle drink a potion of speed. Oh, she can't. Can I just put it in her? That doesn't work. Why did it work earlier? It worked earlier. Okay, triple chop. One, two, three. 
We still need to do 400 hit points damage. Oh man, how is this gonna work? She used her bonus action. She did? Okay, we dropped our spear here, which kind of sucks. Um, I'm gonna do Necrotic Spirit Guardians on 5th level. These guys are taking a buttload of damage from that. And then she's just gonna stay there? We're gonna send out a spiritual weapon on... Damn, third level behind Raphael. Like, I gotta get as much damage in as possible. Okay, I don't really think I have anything that could damage him that much. I could plop down a hypnotic pattern on everybody again, but I feel like I'm gonna. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna, you know, screw my own party over before I do anything good. Damn, only 51% chance against him. That is insane. Do I get high ground? Fuck it. We're going in. 25 damage. Good shit. Good shit. Drink. A potion of... Wait, I can drink a potion of speed. I want to drink a potion of speed. And then I can Eldritch Blast three times more. Pop, pop, pop! Another 15. It's Hope's turn. I swear, he's like almost impossible to hit. Can I revoke guest status on one of the Cambions? <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> That's really useful. Mass healing word. Fourth level. Couple ammo. Shadow Heart is still there. She's not doing good. <laughs> she did an opportunity attack with her fist. Okay, can you drink a potion of speed? You have a potion of speed, Carlink. Drink it. We need all the attacks. He's still stunned. He is still stunned. But only for Carlink's turn, and then that's it. Reckless won't change anything, so we're not doing that. Okay, one hit. He's at half health. Another hit. And a crit. 280 hit points. This guy's blinded. Gets an opportunity attack. I'm just gonna use hope to banish all these people. Raise a fire. Scion attack flash. We're trading damage. Using strike on Lizelle is a miss because they're blinded. They have disadvantage. Oh, is it the big guy again? Oh, he tried to go for Shadowheart. Oh shit. But he took big damage. Piercing strike on Karlak. Another attack on Karlak. She is fine. Raphael, not stunned anymore. Can we stun him again? Can we stun him again? Can we do something to him that's gonna mess him up? Oh, mate. Purple Worm Toxin. Oh, he's resistant to poison damage for sure. Poison won't do it. Like, we're just gonna keep chopping as much as we can. Potion of Speed. We're all gonna go potion of speed and then just chop, 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 chop like like there's no tomorrow. Miss, I don't care. Another miss. 24 damage. Five misses. 
Shadowheart, you gotta tank these devils. You can do it. Scorching race on Karlak. That's like a fart in the wind. We're dealing damage to all of these guys. Can I pick up the spear? We got the spear again. Can I equip the spear? Or would that be my action? That's my action, right? Okay. How about... This target can't be polymorphed. What do I do against these guys? Do I cast silence on the whole troop? I'm gonna silence them all. And then our fighters are just gonna chop, chop, chop. Because that's all they can do. Who needs a healing word? Tabaluga? No, you need to heal yourself. You can't heal yourself. You can healing word yourself. Do that. Seven hit points. You never know when you need them. Tabaluga! Tabaluga can't cast spells. But we can step out of the darkness. Uh, not the darkness, the silence. Am I still silenced? Now I'm not silenced anymore. I can do six Eldritch Blasts, but they only have a 20% chance. Maybe I'm just gonna take out the Cambions? So even if he starts doing stuff again... Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna help. Let's hit this guy twice. And this guy once. That is... Triple nine for the damage. We got three more. Okay, this guy should be dead. And he gets another two. Seven left. Come on, mate. Fuck. Mage hand. Right in the middle of these guys. Just to fuck with them. <laughs> Spiritual weapon. Come on, poke his ass. That's a miss. Hope. Can you banish... Wait. You can't banish anybody anymore? You can't do it anymore. Oh, she's silenced. Wait, can she... Can she banish his ass? Why can't she do anything? Disarmed. Wait, she can't do anything with her weapon? Why? Take the hit. Critical miss, thank god. Pick up your weapon. Why can't she do shit? She can only throw it. Can't cast spells. Silence. Huh? Okay. Hope wasted her turn. Karlak goes reckless. Four attacks. First one. Second one. Third one. And fourth one. Three hits. 200 hit points left. Let's... Add oil of accuracy to our weapon. This guy's blinded and silenced. Hellish Rebuke won't do much. Let's charm his ass. Didn't work. He's striking again. Tabaluga is tough. X against Lizelle. Lizelle is still standing. Miss Shadowheart goes invisible. Karlik is still taking it. What is he gonna do? He's silenced. Opportunity attack. Crit. 31 damage. He gets one from Lazelle. Miss. He needs to leave. The He's not silenced anymore. Consume souls. And then he does an AoE. That did nothing. How did that not do anything? Because it was in the silenced area? 
Okay, let's take on the Cambions. We got six attacks on Lazelle. Keep that in mind. That's one down. I'm gonna shove. No, he can stay there. He can stay there. I'm gonna jump to Raphael. Take the opportunity attack. That's a miss. What's up, babe? Strike on Shadowheart. Shadowheart's still standing. Corilla must be so confused. Poison spray did nothing. Shadowheart's turn. We have one fourth level spell slot uh, left, and that's it. That is it. I can't really do much against him. We're still concentrating on silence. I think I'm gonna keep that up. We're gonna miss this step. Up here. We're doing Guiding Bolt. It's only for one attack. No, I'm not doing Guiding Bolt. Uh, Spirit Guardians Necrotic Damage. Fourth level. It's the last thing I got. Silence drops. And then we're running in. Get both of them. Now we just gotta maintain concentration. Tabaluga. Are we gonna bonk this guy? Or are we gonna do six? I'm gonna do six more Eldritch Blasts on these guys down here. One, two, three. This guy gets free as well. No. Why do I have disadvantage now? Devilishly strong. What does that mean? <laughs> I'm just gonna bonk this guy twice. Are we bonded? I think we are. That's one. That's two. And then shop his ass. Actually worked. Can't believe it. 20% chance. Okay. Uh, spiritual weapon? Poke. That's a miss. Hand? Slap. That's a miss. Hope. But yeah, Hope can't do her remove guest thing anymore. But she still has plenty of guiding bolts. Go second level. We do have advantage on this guy. Or should I? I didn't equip the maze, did I? Yeah, she can't even pick it up. Revoke guest status. Oh my god, there it is. Thank you. I thought it was over here. I don't know why. Karlak! Back in action. She goes. And the great thing is she can just get advantage whenever the fuck she wants. Because of Reckless. 140 hit points left. 120. That's a miss. 95 hit points left on Raphael. Concentration up. Concentration still up. Shadowheart MVP. I'm not gonna do Hellish Rebuke on this guy. Let him become invisible again. Invocation of Eternal Depth. Counterspell! <laughs> ah. <laughs> Ooh! So that, that hurt. Concentration on something broke there. Uh, how do we get advantage? What do you have for us, Lizelle? Arsonist Oil transforms the target's fire resistance into fire vulnerability. 
Targets that are immune to fire are in effect. He's probably immune to fire. Potion of mind reading. It's not gonna do much. Um, no, we're just chopping away. Even if it's a low chance. Wait, there's an eternal depther here. Oh, he summoned it. You fucker. You got chopped. 17. Crit. We got four more attacks. Two misses. Three misses. 33 hit points left. Go for the hand. Good job, buddy. That's all I wanted. <laughs> that Cambion flew into the Spirit Guardians. 16. He's as good as dead. He is as good as dead. Oh, what can Shadowheart do? We only have first level spell slots left. She's gonna pump some healing into Lazelle so she gets the bless. For next turn. And she's gonna chug a greater healing potion. Um, can you attack that person? Spiritual weapon. No, you know what? Spiritual weapon is just gonna go home. Spiritual weapon is like, I think we're done here. Whose turn is it? Who are we waiting for? It's Hope's turn! Oh man. Can Hope land the killing blow? No. Nah. Hope is gonna jump to Shadowheart. And Hope is gonna pump a... Can I not choose the level for the Cure Wounds? A first level Cure Wounds. Fuck it, let's get Shadowheart back. Tabaluga took a triple crit? What is Raphael doing? He gets opportunity attacks. Psionic backlash. He's dead! <laughs> Wait, Corilla! What is happening? What is going on? Okay, we have an imp. All the pillars broke. Um, can I knock out Corilla? I'm gonna go lethal, non-lethal. Oh, we're not guiding bolding that dude. I'm just gonna run into him, right? And he's gonna take damage? I mean, I can jump to Corilla. I'm, I'm kind of afraid it's gonna kill her. It's 48 necrotic. It could very well just end her. Got lucky, Raphael didn't do most of his annoying shit because I stunned him for two turns. And then I put <laughs> haste on my melee fighters and they were just doing like four and six attacks per turn. And I counterspelled him as he was trying to do shit. Okay, I just want to knock her out. Tabaluga will not do that. Tabaluga's gonna... First, this dude. Imp down. And there's still the invisible dude. He's still somewhere. So we should spread out. This went so much better than I thought. Same. <laughs> Same. He only really used the power the pillars gave him once. I mean, he's messing with the wrong people. That's just even even a centuries old devil will have to learn that lesson. Mass healing word. Bam. Everybody is blessed up the wazoo. We're gonna give Shadowheart an extra heal. Whose turn is it? Karlak. Okay, Karlak. Non-lethal force, right? Yes. Knocked out. 
Hope's sister lives. You can also weaken your soul and give you disadvantage on basically everything that didn't happen once. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Or kicking his ass. Okay, now we just gotta wait for the big guy to show up. Can you not turn invisible? Fuck you. How am I supposed to end this? <laughs> he keeps coming back. Do I have a potion of sea invisibility? Is, is that a thing? Do I have a scroll of sea invisibility? A scroll of greater sea invisibility. Cast spell Lazelle. Now I see invisibility, right? Hmm, where might he be? Can I just shoot a spell in there and hope that it hits? I wanna shoot like a fireball, like roughly here. It hit him! Yul Gear's the real boss. Raphael was just a bait. Almost as satisfying of the video I saw of someone just putting 8k into his pockets and one-shotting him with the morning star. <laughs> that is so fucked up that that works. Nothing will stand in my way. But do you reverse pickpocket like mid-fight? Is that how you do it? Silence. Can't cast... Can't speak or cast spells with verbal components. Does that break? Detected. Oh, he's singing again. But I thought he's dead. Uh, I'm just gonna take a couple steps forward so I don't hit my friend. That didn't do shit. Huh. Oh, it did! Never mind. Hello there. We were looking for you, sir. You were mighty invisible the entire time. Let me hit you with a fourth level guiding bolt. There we go. And have you met Karlak? The hammer's gonna fall. Five hit points left. Are you shitting me? Stop it! God damn it! How do I hit this dude? Not like this. I did it. Pinch yourself. Oh no, I, I'm gonna pinch myself. Uh, I expected him to put up more of a fight, to be honest. The man was just stunned all combat. I was just about quite all right with the amount of fight he put up. If anything, I would have preferred less. What a wonderful, jubilant, glorious day. My beautiful sister is mostly intact. I didn't kill her. You broken her in half like a breadstick, but you didn't. I am sorry she fought you. I'm glad she survived. You don't know the half of what she did. When we were children, she always kept the last piece of pastry for me and bloodied the nose of the bullies who pulled my hair. She's my sister. I love her. And that's why I didn't explode and her despite all the years i've lost i have enough love left for you as well i hope it guides you home for the first time since you heard her voice hope seems calm and the peace flows from her into you soothing your very soul i like to imagine tabaluga is the kind of guy who would be like wait that's the guy you were so scared of <laughs> Kind of. You should join. Like, what? Where, where will you go? What will you do? Nowhere but here. I don't quite think I know where anywhere else is anymore. With a lick of paint and a thorough cleaning, this could be a lovely little house. You want to stay? And I can hardly leave. After all, 
Who would ever want to think of hell without hope? I hope I'll see Carilla again one day. She's and unconscious I'll over there. And I'll tell her she's forgiven. I hope I find all the pieces of my mind that fell out of my head over all those years. And that I'll be able to put myself back together again. I hope the echoes of pain will fade. And memories of sorrow will die. And that you'll visit me here someday. And I hope you have a happy ending. Oh, is it DC 30? We tried. We tried recruiting his ass. But it didn't work. We get legendary gloves. Hope is finally free. She plans to give true meaning to the name House of Hope. Soul catching. Oh, it's monk shit. I can't use it. Your unarmed attacks deal an additional 1d10 force damage. Bro. <laughs> On a monk. On a monk. That That is... With flurry of blows, that's five attacks, so that's five d10 on like a high level monk. Five d10 for free. There's so much good gear for the monk. I've seen so many pieces where I was like, this is insane. Constitution plus two. Once per turn on an unarmed hit, you will gain 10 hit points flat. Alternatively, you may forego healing to gain advantage. <clears throat> on attack rolls and saving throws until the end of your next turn. <laughs> this is... that That's the most broken item for monks I have ever seen. Constitution plus two. You punch somebody, you either gain ten hit points or advantage for all the other punches that you're going to do. And your punches deal extra damage. I should f cast this into the hellfire so no monk ever gets this. Because that is ridiculous. Uh, we don't have a short rest anymore. I can't believe we did it. I feel like we can drop the disguises on everybody. Shadowheart is back. Karlak is back. Dude, look at her gauntlets of hill giant strength. Is it hill giant? Hill giant, yeah. Lizelle. Who took your nose, Lizelle? Who did it? I've got a long road ahead. That's the last of Raphael. I'll be glad to no longer have to suffer his smug face. Same. Kalek, I killed the guy who tormented you. I'm fine. No, that was Zarya. Sorry. Get in and get out. We did it. I'm fine. Let's just get in and get out. Do you have nothing else? Lazelle? The hammer is ours. The devil is snuffed out. Our power is undeniable. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Oh, wait. We knocked him out as well. Oh, big buddy. Can I not? <laughs> I can ability drain his charisma. What's his charisma on? It's still like... Not letting me examine anything. Uh, okay, first we turn off lethal force. So I can do this. There we go. I feel like that guy shouldn't stick around. Trident plus one. Breastplate. I wonder what Raphael has. Trident plus one and breastplate. Gorilla is knocked out. Report for Raphael. Somehow, word that the Orphic Hammers in the House of Hope has gotten out and is circulating on the gate's information black market. I have two suspects for this. First, Gortash, who of course knows many of the house's secrets. And second, that Diabolist for Haya, Hellsick. Who I think helped Gortash burgle the Crown of Curses and might have learned about the hammer from him. If I had to guess, I'd wager it was Hellsick, simply because if she has something that's worth money, she'll find a way to sell it. And selling a way to free Orpheus could come with a high price tag. Just... She sold it to... Wait, can I pick up the legendary hammer? 
That's the one that Hope dropped. She summoned it with uh, Divine Intervention. Where did that go? There it is. Devotee's Mace. Plus free enchantment and has the healing aura. And you need to equip your spear again? There we go. No, I haven't looked at Raphael. He's like... <laughs> it looks like he's really inspecting something at this wall. Oh, that's too good. Can I save, load the game, and then actually examine people? Because for some reason it bugged out during the fight. Let's see what he has first. Hell Dusk Armor. Legendary heavy armor. You are considered proficient with this armor while wearing it. When you succeed a saving throw, the caster receives burning for three turns. You have resistance to fire damage and cannot be burned. You take three less damage from all sources. And you can fly? Bruh. And diaries. Can I wear that? Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, anybody can wear that, right? If you're proficient with it. Let's give that to Lizelle. I gotta, I gotta make some room. Let's give these to Lizelle. Goes to Lizelle. Lizelle can carry a lot of shit. Uh, let me sort by weight. What is so heavy? Thieves tools, trap this arm. Cool kits. That staff is pretty heavy. Is my al my alchemy pouch is that heavy? I gotta do this, right? Alchemy? Damn. Anybody can wear it. That is exquisite. Oh my god. Oh, it looks so fucking good. Can I dye it? Do I still have the dye? Or by type? Where's my armor dyes? Lush burgundy. Pale green. No, I had another one. It was not pale green. I had another type of dye. No, I'm definitely gonna give this to Tabaluga. AC 20. He has the highest AC. <laughs> As a warlock. <laughs> As a warlock. I'm gonna make it pale green for now. <laughs> that looks so dorky. I love it. Take an armor from hell and make it dorky as hell. It looks amazing with the hell dusk helmet that goes with it. You mean that one, right? How's that gonna look? Whoa. That looks like some Skyrim armor. Shadowheart with the hat looks pretty good as well. Dude, we look so badass. Can I make everything pale green? We still got a bunch. No, I'm out of pale green. Shit. Deep lilac? Harlequin, black and white. No, that's not. I, I had like a black and green one. I gotta go back to that merchant that sells all the dyes. Sick. Actually, sickest armor. Let's read his diary. A chapter from a diary penned in Raphael's Sibaritic Hand. While I have, over many sumptuous seasons, cast a net of my contractual predilections both far and wide, never have I been so attracted to mortals as I am to those infested by the tadpole. These particular fish find themselves plashing toward their doom, toward a steel hook unblemished by bait. But they resist the current. How in... Ex he uses so many complicated words. 
Uh, how inex uh, inexorable its whelm, its tug, its dark undertow. At the other hand of the fishing pole, the elifid. How the tentacles must quiver like cooled jelly at the prospect of more catches. More and more each day along the troubled riverbank. This process has a name. I sample now aloud. To savor its taste. Ceromorphosis. I shall make crafty use of this development. But with the hook glinting and death so close, what could loom larger in the stricken fish's mind than the prospect of rescue? Oh, this was Act 1. Raphael. Okay. A chapter from a diary penned in Raphael's steady, imperious scrawl. Last night I dreamt of a river. Waist deep I waded it. Rusted hooks curled up from the water like the snaggled teeth of something ancient and diseased and submerged. The moon over the water cracked and fire flew out in the stubby wings of gormless, insanely chirping chicks. He could just say I had a nightmare. You know? I hope you liked the BGM fight. It was great. Whenever there's like music made specifically for one scenario, mm, good stuff. They transformed into wriggling oblongs like sperm, yet by the time they hit the water they were fish with scales of orange and gold. There came a rushing sound, the dark water ablaze as if the fish were matches and the river a snake of oil. Approaching me out of the flames came the tadpole infested. It was one among them who spoke for the rest. They gestured to the melting hooks and suddenly glanced my way. In their face I saw they had the best of me. In waking, my courage has firmed. I progress my plans for the tadpole even now. I am Raphael. I am not easily bested. And the third book is like, oh boy, I can't. If they go here, I'm gonna poop my pants. Final chapter from a diary, penned in Raphael's hand. Here and there, his composed hand stiffens and moves erratically, as if he were by, tam by time seized by emotion, both powerful and unexpected. The plot thickens, goes the aphor aphorism, entirely inadequate. The plot mutates, it fluctuates. I have conceived no less than 13 variations by which I might seize the crown of Carsis. Yet in the tumult of this eternally flowing river of schemes, I, the most careful of fishermen, finds his catch elusive and difficult to wrangle. Even in cooperation, such ambiguity and delicious surprise, but the hook has snagged, the doom of ceromorphosis has abated. Yet they could not predict, could they? Could they? That in leaving behind the river, they have in fact welcomed the fishbowl. I am master here, a prince of bargains cloaked in cunning like scarlet satin. All that hidden under sublimely obvious truths that cannot be discounted. So the fisherman reels. The tadpoles are my catch. Struggle as they might, rive as they wish, flop and squirm and fresh, with every ounce of strength, no matter. By all the reeking flames of hell, I will not be denied. And look who got denied! Can I try? S wait. A long way to go still. Can you cast the sky south on me? You can only cast the sky south on yourself, right? This is the one thing that I'm definitely directing my friend towards in his playthrough. Of all the optional shit you can do in the game, this is the best. And it gives you pretty much the best gear in the game as well. I mean, the amulet and the gloves on Karlak make her super fucking strong and super fucking tanky. I have the armor now that looks evil as fuck. But it's dope. <laughs> <laughs> it has crazy good stats. I'm gonna keep that. I could have put it on Lazel, but I mean, bumping my AC to 21 with no downsides. <laughs> I'm taking that. <laughs> okay, but one thing I saw is you can you can cast the sky self on yourself. Can I speak with? 
respond. The corpse does not respond. If you get the message, like, the corpse does not want to speak to its killer, you can cast Disguise Self on yourself and then cast Speak With Dead and then it works. Like, like somebody else killed them and, and you're finding their corpse. Let's have a look at the red okay, where's Hope? Is Hope gone? Already? Can I sign in the guest book? Can I sign here? Invited guests. Alistair Black Cloak. Social call. High Inquisitor Virilius Receptor. Involuntary guests. Silvara Savakis. Dude. Fabius Creek. Oh shit. Those are from Descent into Avernus. She's like a wizard in Candle Keep. And she kind of like helps the party get to hell. And he's like the former ruler of Alterel, who signed the initial contract that Alterel is like doomed to go to hell. Like he signed it and for like 40 years everything was fine, but then like on the day, 40 years later, it got sucked into hell. And that's how Descent into Avernus starts. Are we good here? Everybody... What's up for discussion? Can I talk to Hope one more time? You can also kill Asterion when you meet him, then revive him and he makes fun of you for doing that. <laughs> are you still here? Or are you but a dream? Oh, uh, we're done looting. I just wanted to say... Uh, keep hoping. Goodbye. That was the dumbest last thing I could have said to her. Alright, I'm hopping into the portal. Mind, limb, and freedom, and destroyed the contract that bound you. And I killed the, the devil. Contract you never should have signed. I was just curious. I want to understand what the devil had to offer. There is only one thing to understand. My boyfriend is talking to me in it my head. I'm sorry. Only itself. Anything it promised to deliver, it would recover tenfold. You realized the error of your ways and corrected them. That's hot. <laughs> that Especially makes me horny. So Come visit me <laughs> tonight. You saw for yourself what the chosen are capable of. But did you also see their weakness? N no. If you succeed the fight with Raphael with Yugir on your side, and su he survives, he will join your company as well for later. That's cool. What does your boyfriend think of the devil you fucked in hell? <laughs> we probably see it. Did you also see their their weakness? No. It was their union that made them. They had an almost flawless plan to dominate Feyrun. But their distrust But Chronetic, their keep in mind, this is my first playthrough. Must not fall into the same trap. Don't tell me shit. They must trust one another. If, if it's like little what ifs at, at some points when we're like done with them, that's fine. Um, but don't tell me anything. Otherwise, I'm gonna, I'm gonna kick you out faster than Karlik mentions that she's horny. Just saying, you know, like every, a lot of people here are probably further than, than I am. I'm slow because I only stream the game. I don't play it off stream. Um, you're more than welcome to stay, but keep the information to yourself. I know it's hard. I know it's hard, but you can do it. Uh, we must not fall into the same trap. We must trust each other. I'm just working with, we're just work and fuck buddies, mate. There's no trust. I'm disappointed to hear that after all we shared. Nonetheless, our fates are bound. And in the absence of a happier union, I will accept a useful one. That's an owlbear. You owl bear. <laughs> yourself ingenious for having slain a devil. But you have merely ironed out a wrinkle. The elder brain, 
will not be such an easy fight. Oh, you leave that to me. Time we resume our journey to find it. Okay. We're back. And I guess I can come to the House of Hope whenever I want. I'm exhausted. Let's go I'm downstairs, so tell the lady that we just killed like the guy that her portal led to. Saving the game, very important. And then we're gonna do one more long rest and see if anything happens at night. Uh, hello, I'm back. Trips to the hells are usually one way. Especially when the traveler causes the kind of trouble you did. I knew you were a thief. Didn't realize you were a killer. Oh. Raphael's death is already causing quite a stir across the hells. Oopsie daisy. It's a rare thing for a mortal to slay a devil of his stature. I'm impressed. And just a little bit intimidated. I mean, the armor is... Your coin is always <laughs> welcome here. <laughs> kind of wild. And so are you, devil slayer. I, I tip my wizard hat. Don't let a little thing like explosion stop you from achieving your dreams. Uh, so, do, did I, do I get a discount? Is there a Devil Slayer discount? Welcome back, Devil Slayer. I got what some stuff to sell. She has all my money. Oh, I forgot. Um, take the monk gloves. They're nuts. They're absolutely fucking nuts, but nobody can use them, so you can have it. Uh, what else do we have? Did we lose some valuables? We got a diamond. Sapphire. I gotta put my outfit back on. I forgot about that. I have the same newspaper twice. You can have one of those. What else do we have? A collection of hats. We're keeping that. You can have the regal helmet. Nobody is using that. Uh, what she just said, she was just like, you're insane for doing this. But I respect it because it doesn't happen a lot. And I'm intimidated and afraid of your whole party because you people are mad for doing what you just did. I'm going to sell my elven chain. It was a good time with that armor, but that's over. That's some gold. Lazel, we have normal D&D stuff. <laughs> I still have the armor. Cerebral Citadel armor. But honestly, the one that Lazel has is a little better. She looks badass in it. And it has a little, it's like belly free, so that's kind of hot, but you know. Uh, I'm selling this. I'm selling that. Gold bar. Uh, what else? A ring. Goblet. Gold necklace. Even a rest. Money is money. And money never stings. Oh, I think money is very stinky. It's usually the people around the money. That's pretty stinky. Uh, Dark Justiciar helmet. A thousand bucks. I take it. Or I sell it. Selling that. That's another thousand. And Karlak, do you have anything? She has all the infernal alloy that we never got to use. So you can finally sell all your extra stuff because you gave her your money. Yeah, it, it's like a bank, basically. We're basically like loaning it out. I still have the ritual deck of Char. I'm keeping that. Okay. I think we're done. He has. Do you have a green dye? Sinful red and bone white. Custard and pink. Feywild green. Let me buy those. Now you've seen what I have for thee. Remember. Shh, shh, shh. I, I want to dye my arm. Wait, I gave that to Carlike, right? Carlike buy it. 
Where's the die? Light blue die. Wait, who did I buy the die with? I bought four. Not on car. Is it on me? Deep lilac. Yellow die. Am I dumb? A lady, excuse me, are we dumb? Did I not Welcome just back, buy a thing? What can I do for you? In full red. Oh, she didn't have enough money, did she? Okay. I I'm, I'm gonna give this whole armor a new spin. It it looks a little uncoordinated. Uh, we have five, so that should be enough for the... No, we have four. Let's start with the armor. Yes! Yes, 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 yes. Big yes. Oh, by the way, did I tell you I ordered the Planescape? Um, they're, they're bringing out, like, 5th edition Planescape. So, back in the good old days, you had, like, books where every... Like, every outer plane had a shit ton of lore and, like, little adventures and all that fun stuff. And they're bringing out a new version for... Oh, let's do the hat. Ooh, the hat looks sick as well. For 5th edition. And I ordered the collector's edition of that. It was only 70 bucks. Like, usually one of the books is like 50. And all of them together, in like the special alternate cover and everything, for 70 bucks. I saw that and I was like, what? Like, this is all you need for everything that is outside of the material plane. That you're playing in D&D. Forever. That's all you need. Dude, I look fucking dope. I love that. Oh! God damn. Oh, but you got the one with all the, the minis, right? You got all the minis. Okay, Tabaluga looks fucking devil possessed. And I love it. Shadowheart, we did it. I wasn't expecting it. But I'm glad to have some company on this journey. I never use a stain in this game. Is it only for glamour? Yes. It's just color. Like, Shadowheart, I gave like a gray and black. Has like a little purple in it. Karlek has, I think she has the bone white and scarlet. And Lizelle is always covered in blood, so you can't really tell with her. It, it's dope. Nothing special. This is everything. Looks are everything in an RPG. Have you ever played Monster Hunter? That's all the people are talking about. Okay. We're gonna do a long rest. Because it's about time. And it's really cool. If you have like mid like mixed gear that doesn't really go along together well with these dyes you can make it all blend and it's great okay is anybody feeling talkative i play final fantasy 14 and glamour is a must i know i i play it too a little bit soldier <laughs> people go hard People go hard on that. How was it in the House of Hope for you, Karlek? Ugh, thank the gods it's over, I say. My last trip to the hells ever, ever. Wasn't any part of you tempted to stay? Hope will probably turn that place into a real home. No such thing as a home in the hells. If Hope's happy, good for her. But mark my words, some devil or other will push in and claim the place sooner or later. Stick around in Avernus long enough, and you'll run out of hope entirely. No, soldier. I'd rather live out my days in the world I love, than live forever in a world I hate. 
I don't know much, but I do know that. I respect that, Karlak. I respect that. Well, our next run is going to be Dark Urge and chat votes. Chat plays Dark Urge. <laughs> to slay a devil in his domain is to end him entire. Or it should be. I am still primed to hear some slimy final rhyme from beyond the grave. Okay, let's see what everybody has to say to us killing a devil. Oh, Lizelle can still see invisibility, damn. Is something burdening you? Lizelle is completely unimpressed by being in hell. That makes sense for a character. I wasn't expecting it, but I'm fine. What's on your mind? Okay, she doesn't have anything new either. Scratch! My puppy! Hope you're keeping well, friend. I was in hell. I need my good boy. Good puppy. Get used to the armor. It looks rough, I know, but still the same guy in it. Okay. Asterion, any any comments? Any comments on killing a devil in his own turf? <laughs> Defeating a devil in his own home feels very, very good. Dude, you're level one. <laughs> you're level one, Asterion. <laughs> but yeah, I can't examine anymore. That's still bug. Um... He's level 1 with a level 10 attitude. <laughs> okay. I'm going to cut it here. Before anything happens in a long rest, I'm 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 done with House of Hope. This was nuts. Like as Flex put it pretty accurately earlier, this is like the best optional like side content I have seen so far. I'm just amazed by like the things that you can miss. Imagine missing that on your first playthrough. Because you just ran past the house and you didn't pay attention or like whatever reason. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. I wish you a good one. Uh, there will be no stream tomorrow. I got like a family thing I gotta attend. And I won't have time to stream tomorrow. Uh, Wednesday... The normal day off. I'll be back Thursday with Valheim. We're gonna play some more Valheim. And then on Friday we play BG3 again. I wish you a good one. Hop on the YouTube if you wanna watch some VODs. If you wanna watch some clips. Keep in mind like liking, commenting, like all the thing that all the YouTubers tell you all the time applies to me as well. Um, check that out if you wanna you know the drill. Discord, all that stuff. You can interact with all of that. Uh, if people are lurking that have not followed yet. I'm, I'm poking you right in the eye. How dare you. I see you on Thursday. That's a long time. I'm sorry. I'll be back on Thursday. Bye-bye.